We've got footage that'll make you question everything. Did I just get you? <laughs> you sure? Yep. Shadowy figures, creatures out of nightmares, and glimpses of a reality that might just break your brain. Ready to step into the unknown? The woods offer a sense of peaceful isolation, a place to escape the world. But what if that feeling is an illusion? What if, hidden within the quiet, there are secrets that will prove everything we think is safe is a lie? <laughs> Did that just get you? <laughs> you sure? Yep. Did you see it? Watch closely. Blink, and you might miss it. A cloaked figure streaking past the hiker. The sudden shift in the man's tone confirms he saw it too. So what is it? A bizarre prank or something far more unsettling? Perhaps a glitch in our reality? A hint of a hidden world overlapping with our own? Or truly an invisible man? Maybe we will never know, but one thing is certain. The familiar comfort of the woods is forever tainted. Next time I am out in the wild, I will carry the unsettling memory of this footage. A chilling reminder that the feeling of solitude might be a dangerous illusion. Sometimes, what scares us most isn't what we can't see. It's what's right in front of us. Under construction sites, like old abandoned places, hold a strange unease. It's something I can't quite explain. This person makes his way through the unfinished house at night, his camera light cutting through the darkness. Something stirs in the darkness, just beyond his vision. He turns the camera and captures this. Honestly, I've seen my share of the bizarre, but this, this is chilling. No guess I can make seems to fit. It's definitely not human. What person would linger in darkness like that? and it seems completely unfazed by the human. That stare directly into the camera is haunting. Is this the proof we've been looking for? Are there truly aliens among us? Whatever that creature is, I can't blame the person for leaving in a hurry. That's exactly what I would have done. Our next video underscores the fragility of life. One moment, everything seems normal. The next, disaster strikes. This man pauses on a mountain road where a few rocks have fallen. He's inspecting them, trying to gauge where they came from. He watches the slope above warily. For a reason we can't see, he turns and sprints back to his car reversing with frantic urgency. Just seconds later, we see why. A massive landslide tears down the mountainside, right where he stood, had he not glanced up, had he hesitated. The ending could have been tragic. Fate had a different plan that day, but it's a stark reminder. Against the raw power of nature, we are truly vulnerable. Back to the spine-chilling world of abandoned houses. Take it from me. I wouldn't set foot in one alone. Not even with a flashlight and a baseball bat. Especially not at night. Seriously, count me out. Clearly, this place is deserted. So why on earth would someone be there in the dark? And what the hell is that thing? Why zoom in when you should be running for your life? This is creepy on so many levels. Is it a doll? A dog? Why does it have that unsettling grin, staring right at the camera? Sure, the video quality isn't great, but for some reason, this feels... real. It sends shivers down my spine. Like that thing knows exactly who I am and where to find me. Sinister? 
doesn't even begin to describe it. Maybe it's the 2020's answer to Chucky, just as horrifying. Ghosts, aliens, you name it. Nothing tops the danger of human stupidity. More lives are lost to bad decisions than anything else, I bet. Alright, I zoomed in. This was exciting. Oh my god! Seriously, look at the size of that snake. Why tempt fate, especially with zero protection? The lady yelling, don't get bit. She's got the right idea. This is why women generally outlive men. She gonna get bit. Yeah, let her bite herself so Let it go, dude. Surprise. You got bit. That's what happens when you mess with wild animals. They're unpredictable and dangerous for a reason. Next time you see something like this, back away and call the expert. Let them handle it. Trying to be a hero is a recipe for a hospital visit. If you are enjoying this so far, consider subscribing. It really helps me keep this channel going. We humans often forget our place in the grand scheme of things. We encroach on wild spaces, exploit natural resources, and show a blatant disregard for the world around us. But sometimes, nature finds its own ways to push back. Not always with cataclysmic events, but with something far more cunning. This fox is on a mission of vengeance. It targets the very symbol of our intrusion, the camera, and there's an undeniable humor to this. This fox knows exactly what it's doing. It wastes no time and goes straight for the source. A few calculated bites, a peek into its cavernous maw, and the deed is done. It vanishes as quickly as it arrived. The camera? Damaged. But not destroyed. A subtle warning, perhaps. It's a reminder. Respect the wild, and it might just spare you the worst of its wrath. The wonders of nature never cease to amaze us. We often imagine how bizarre aliens might be, but sometimes the strangest creatures are right here on Earth. <laughs> Take a look at what this fisherman found in a Chinese river. Is it a massive snake, some unknown type of alligator, or something completely undiscovered? It shares traits with so many different creatures. Snake, alligator, even heinz of a frog. Whatever it is, it's both fascinating and unsettling. The muddy water makes it hard to gauge its true size, adding to the mystery. But one thing's odd. The fisherman acts like this is an ordinary encounter. He sounds almost casual. Does he know this creature? Is it somehow familiar? There's an eerie calmness to his reaction? Let's just hope he knows what he's dealing with and that this video doesn't have a grim ending. From the bizarre world of unknown creatures to the familiar realm of human recklessness, why can't we learn to respect the dangers of the wild? At first glance, you might think this guy caught a big fish. There's excitement in the air, the illusion of safety. But he's not grappling with dinner. He's hooked a shark and he's in a tiny kayak while his friends cheer him on from their boat. See how it tows him around? Any moment, he could capsize, ending up right in its jaws. And there you go. He's in the water, just inches from the shark. Panic is understandable. The shark is still on the line, and he's intent on resuming this insane duel. A single bite could change his life, or end it. Is the thrill really worth that risk? This is arrogance in its purest form. 
We must learn to coexist with nature or face the consequences. I hope good sense prevails. As I said, the strangest creatures aren't on distant planets. They're lurking right here in our oceans. Take a look at this footage from Peg Island in Croatia. Honestly, would you ever have dreamed something like this exists? I wouldn't. At least not outside a microscope. If those strands weren't wriggling like that, you might mistake it for a strange fruit or flower. But look at the way they move, as if caught in an invisible current. It's deeply unsettling. Now, this thing is tiny, but imagine it's scaled up 5 or 10 feet long. Would you go anywhere near it? It's like those horrifying, all-consuming aliens from science fiction movies. Mother Nature is truly mind-boggling and just a little terrifying. Let's just hope this creature stays small and remains confined to the deep seas. Moving on from the strange to the downright spooky. Now, this is police dashcam footage, so I'm assuming what we're about to see is the real deal. Just a quiet, country road at night. Then, out of nowhere, this white, hazy shape materializes in the middle of the road, and the car passes straight through it. Did you catch that? The officer definitely did. Look, he's stopping, turning around to investigate. And this time, you can almost make out a human-shaped figure. It crosses the road, then simply, if you missed it, let's slow things down. Videos like this throw all my assumptions out the window. Could it be a spirit? Is this a glimpse of what awaits us after death? Do we retain our forms, wandering unseen forever? If so, with all the souls throughout history, why are sightings so rare? Or is this some strange trick of the light and I'm just getting carried away? Spooky stuff tends to do that to me. Either way, you decide. From spooky to downright unsettling. They definitely resemble worms, but that inky black color is so alien. Maybe all those sci-fi movies have me primed to see space creatures everywhere. Jokes aside, I've never encountered anything quite like this. There's something deeply unsettling about them. Why are they huddled together like that? Most worms you see are solitary, or scattered unless they're trapped in a confined space. Here they're in the open, clustered by choice. Honestly, I can't come up with a logical reason. These creatures give me major creeps. Back to the beaches. Next stop, the beautiful beaches of South Goa, India. But pristine sands can hide unexpected things. Forget love letters tucked inside bottles. This one is a living ecosystem. Snails and other creatures encrust the glass. It's less romantic, more fascinatingly gross. See how those shell-covered things squirm and wriggle. Maybe there's treasure inside, or a forgotten message. From the bizarre to the heartwarming. <laughs> In the wild, a dog would be a lion's snack, not a friend. But here, surprisingly, they seem like the best of companions. The mighty lion, so gently, taking the dog's paw. The dog stands firm, and when it walks away, the lion follows, persistent. Nature, as we constantly discover, balances cruelty with unexpected tenderness. Even wild creatures, so seemingly fierce, teach us lessons about gentleness and friendship. 
If you got so far in the video, it means you're a dedicated viewer. Thank you. And if you subscribe and hit the bell button, I promise to keep posting these for you to enjoy. Back to India, this time to Tamil Nadu, where we witness yet another of nature's incredible oddities, reminding us that reality can be far stranger than fiction. <laughs> A cow has given birth, and the entire village has gathered to see the new calf. But there's a reason for the crowd. This is no ordinary newborn. Take a look. It has two heads. And unlike conjoined twins we sometimes see, these heads aren't fused in any way. It's more like a single body with two completely separate faces, each seemingly with a mind of its own. Truly astonishing. How does this happen? Is it a case of random mutation? Or part of some design we're too limited to comprehend? Nature continues to surprise and challenge us, reminding us that, for all our knowledge, the universe remains fundamentally mysterious and awe-inspiring. All right, hold on to your hats. Uh, what is it, a one hour? Uh, it's a bearded dragon. It's a bearded dragon? A bearded dragon, yeah. This bearded dragon has one body, two heads. Does it spark a memory? Anyone remember that cartoon, Dragon Tales? These guys aren't just a real-life version of those conjoined dragons. They even share their names. Zack and Wheezy. Adorable, right? But here's an even more interesting part. Their owner has a big family. Six kids and six grandkids. And she was offered $78,000 for the twins. Yet she refused. Money can't buy everything, she said. It's heartening to find this kind of compassion. A reminder that even amidst the harsh realities of the world, human empathy endures. Okay, back into the weird world of worms. Just give me a moment to shake off those heebie-jeebies. They linger. Honestly, who would keep these things in a jar? What's the appeal? Okay, let's examine this. It's worm-shaped, but with a tail. That's already unsettling. And what on earth are those black dots? Not eyes. Horns? This is a whole new level of bizarre. Turns out I may have a touch of scolesophobia. That's fear of worms. Definitely time to move on. We all need that chill out time, even animals. Forget fancy spays. Sometimes you make do with what you've got. Check out this giant anteater taking a late night dip. We're not so different from our furry, scaly, or feathered friends. At the end of the day, Simple pleasures are the best. There's something so calming about a good bath. I'm getting relaxed just watching. See how it basks in the cool water. No worries. Just enjoying some well-deserved alone time. Let's all take a moment with this anteater. Almost makes me want to ditch everything for a long soak of my own. Especially after all those creepy worms from earlier. Sadly, Amazing creatures like this giant anteater are vulnerable to extinction. That's why organizations like the People's Trust for Endangered Species are so important. Their work protects animals just like this. If you enjoyed this clip, consider donating to them to help protect these incredible creatures. Next up, a creature that proves looks can be deceiving. Here we go, ready? Put it in there. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Do it again, do it again, do it again! Oh. 
at first glance, a squid seems all graceful and flowing, but that appearance hides a shocking truth. Let's see what happens when they get hold of a soda can. Did you see that? It didn't just crush it. It took a clean bite. Were your chunk right out? That's some serious jaw power. See it go in for another. And again. Imagine if that were your finger instead of metal. Bottom line. If you ever see one of these in the wild, admire from a distance. Trust me. Let's end with a glimpse of the giant anteater in its natural habitat. Check it out. With that shaggy fur and crazy long snout, it looks like something straight out of a prehistoric picture book. But its odd appearance is deceptive. It's clumsy, yet oddly graceful, a total contradiction, and hear that sound it makes when threatened. Magnificent in its own strange way, wouldn't you agree? These amazing creatures deserve to thrive alongside us. We can all play a part in protecting them. Please consider donating to the People's Trust for Endangered Species. Together, we can make a difference for animals like this. This hiker's video looks like something straight out of a scary story. It shows a dark forest at night, but what's truly chilling is a pair of glowing red eyes peering back from the distance. The faint outline of a figure suggests something humanoid, but the darkness hides its details. Those eyes, though, burning red and filled with an unsettling feeling, hold the hiker's attention. For a tense few moments, the eyes stare right at the camera, sending shivers down your spine. Then, in a movement that makes the blood run cold, the figure raises a hand as if in warning. The video cuts out abruptly, leaving us wondering what happened next. Did the hiker flee in terror? This encounter is a reminder of the strange and mysterious things that might lurk in the deep woods, especially at night. Hikers often stumble upon amazing sights in nature, but this encounter might be a bit too realistic. A hiker recently captured footage of a strange figure standing in the woods, so lifelike it nearly gave him a heart attack. The video shows a tall wooden figure with what seems like a tiny person inside. As the hiker gets closer, they discover it's not a magical creature, but an incredibly detailed and realistic statue. The carving is so lifelike, it could easily be mistaken for a mythical forest spirit. While the encounter was certainly surprising, the statue's craftsmanship is truly impressive. The intricate details and beautiful artistry are undeniable. However, I suggest that the artist might want to reconsider placing such realistic artwork deep in the woods, as it could be quite a shock for unsuspecting hikers. Remember those magical creatures we dreamt of as kids, like unicorns? Well, this video from Uzbekistan might rekindle that childhood wonder. The video features a truly unusual sight. A steer with three horns. It has the typical two horns of its kind, but also a single straight horn right in the middle, reminiscent of a unicorn. This special steer, raised by a village in Uzbekistan, became quite the local celebrity. Some even went as far as calling it a divine being reborn. While the extra horn could be a result of a genetic mutation, similar to how some animals are born with extra limbs. These mutations are happening more often these days. The big question now is, what do we call this amazing creature? It's not quite a unicorn, since it's a steer, not a horse. Can you think of a cool name for this one-of-a-kind animal?
Have you seen this doorbell camera footage from California? It's causing a stir online, with people debating whether it's real or a hoax. The video shows a strange humanoid figure approaching a porch and looking right into the camera. Its long, wiggling fingers and bulging eyes are definitely creepy. The figure makes odd hand gestures for a full minute before darting away. It's certainly unsettling, especially considering it happened in the middle of the night. But take a closer look. This might not be a paranormal encounter after all. The figure's unmoving pupils within the bulging eyes suggest a mask. And my guess is that it is not a real creature. I think this is an elaborate Halloween prank, and whoever did it deserves a round of applause for creepiness. This next story may be disturbing for some, so please proceed with caution. And I know it isn't really thematic for the channel, but this one really shocked me and I wanted to share with you. In December 2022, doctors in China treated an unusual medical case that shocked many people. In an extremely rare situation, they performed surgery to remove a fetus from the brain of a one-year-old child. It all started when the child's parents noticed they were developing motor skills slower than expected. Further tests revealed an enlarged head and fluid buildup in the brain. Using a magnetic resonance imaging scan, doctors made a shocking discovery that a malformed fetus was present inside the child's skull. This condition, called fetus in fetus, is incredibly rare, affecting only about 1 in 500,000 births. While the exact cause is unknown, it happens during development when one twin becomes absorbed by the other. Thankfully, the fetus was surgically removed. However, it's unclear how the child fared after surgery as the information isn't readily available online. We can only hope they made full recovery. This next video is one of those that makes you scratch your head and wonder, is it real or a clever fake? The footage comes from South America and shows a bizarre creature sprawled out on a bench. The thing looks like something straight out of a movie. It has strange, smooth skin, and its legs seem to blend into its tail. Its arms, and especially its face, are unlike anything we've seen before. While the creature doesn't move in the video, making it look dead, its body seems too well preserved to be a decomposing animal. The arms also have a weird membrane connecting them to the body, similar to flying squirrels. This detail suggests it might have been able to glide or even fly. To me, the creature looks almost too perfect. It's hard to tell if it's a real alien or a very well-made prop, maybe for a horror movie promotion. One thing's for sure, if you ever stumbled upon something like this lying next to your house, seeing it your heart would probably skip a couple of beats. If you are enjoying this so far, consider subscribing. It really helps me keep this channel going. Have you ever wondered what a real-life SpongeBob SquarePants might look like underwater? Well, a team of researchers might have the answer. A deep-sea exploration vehicle cruising off the north coast of Hawaii captured footage of a massive creature that would make Bikini Bottom proud. This giant sponge, roughly the size of a minivan, is one of the oldest living things on Earth. The impressive sponge measured a whopping 12 feet long and 7 feet wide, beating the previous record holder by a significant margin. That earlier sponge, discovered in shallow Canadian waters back in the 1800s, only reached 11 feet long and 3 feet wide. These fascinating creatures can live for hundreds or even thousands of years, meaning this particular sponge has likely witnessed a lot of history. While the researchers didn't disturb this specific sponge, they did collect samples from similar creatures during a previous expedition to learn more about these deep sea giants. This video, originally shared on Reddit in 2012, has gained attention for its creepy content and supposed government involvement. However, it's important to approach such claims 
with a critical eye. The video, allegedly filmed by two teenage brothers in 2011, shows them playing with a trampoline. As one brother films the other performing tricks, something strange appears in the background. The cameraman zooms in, revealing a figure resembling the Slender Man, a tall, faceless entity from online horror stories. The video then cuts short as the brothers, supposedly terrified, run away. Following this, the uploader on Reddit claims the original upload was removed by the US government, sparking speculation and questions about the legitimacy of the video and the government's alleged involvement. This video from Canada shows a rabbit with some unusual zombie-like features. But fear not, it's not a zombie apocalypse. The homeowner filmed the rabbit in their backyard zooming in to show strange growths on its head. These black spikes you see might look scary, but they're actually caused by something called a papillomavirus. Papillomaviruses are actually quite common, affecting both humans and animals. In animals, they cause growths called warts, which is what you see on the rabbit in the video. While the warts might look a bit bizarre, they aren't a sign of a zombie virus. It's understandable to feel bad for the rabbit though. These warts can be uncomfortable, and in some cases, they can even be serious. Also, papillomaviruses are usually fatal. So next time you see a weird looking animal, remember, it's probably not a zombie. It's more likely a common virus causing an unpleasant condition. This video from Africa captures a dramatic encounter, a battle between two snakes. It takes place on a road where one snake appears to be gaining the upper hand. They are coiled around each other. However, the patterned snake has managed to swallow almost half of its opponent's body. While the video shows a one-sided fight, it's important to note that snakes don't typically seek out their own kind as prey. They share similar resources and food sources, so eliminating another snake through eating, as seen here, removes a competitor. A researcher studying Decker eagles in a forest had a nest camera capture a shocking and disturbing scene. The nighttime video shows the peaceful eagle family resting in their nest when something unexpected strikes. A flash appears, and one eagle is struck on the head. The other eagles are startled, and the attacked eagle ducks its head. This attacker swoops down repeatedly with lightning speed, targeting the same eagle until it seems to give up. The attacker then turns to the remaining eagles before the video cuts out. This relentless attacker was an owl a bird known for hunting other birds' nests at night due to their superior vision in the darkness. While owls are often depicted as wise and gentle creatures, this video showcases their fierce, predatory side, something many viewers might not have realized. Ever heard the saying, watch where you step at the beach? Well, this video from Florida shows why. In the clip, a fisherman can be seen digging in the sand when they unearth a massive crab unlike anything you've ever seen. This strange creature is a horseshoe crab, and it's truly enormous. The fisherman then flips the crab over, and we can see multiple legs and a flattened underside that kind of resembles a beetle. Even its shell has a beetle-like look. These horseshoe crabs are like living fossils. They haven't changed much in over 440 million years. That means they were around way before dinosaurs, stomping around the oceans 200 million years ago. Another cool fact, horseshoe crab blood is blue. Unlike us humans with red blood, horseshoe crabs have a special protein called hemocyanin that makes their blood appear blue. So next time you're at the beach, keep an eye out for these fascinating creatures. They're like the grandfathers of dinosaurs, and stepping on them wouldn't be a very polite welcome. Ever walk through the woods at night and hear an eerie laugh? Well, this video from Canada might explain what you heard. Researchers place trail cameras in the woods to study foxes. 
but they captured something unexpected. <laughs> fox laughing. The video shows a fox exploring the forest at night, digging for something. Suddenly, another fox enters the frame, and both foxes let out a sound that's eerily similar to a human laugh. This might seem strange, but foxes can actually make sounds that resemble human laughter. In the video, the foxes continue their activities with one carrying its prey back to its den. This clip is a reminder that the animal world can surprise us in many ways. While it might sound human-like, it's important to remember that these are just sounds foxes naturally make to communicate with each other. My friends often ask why I prefer dogs over cats, and this video from Canada perfectly illustrates my point. In the clip, we see a backyard with a massive black bear casually strolling through. In the background, the resident dogs bark fiercely, trying to warn the bear. The bear, unfazed, heads towards a bird feeder attached to a tree. As the bear investigates, the homeowner opens the door, allowing the previously restrained dog to join the fight. Both dogs bravely charge at the bear, grounding it despite their smaller size. The surprised bear, overwhelmed by their aggression, tries to run away, but is surrounded again. Realizing it might be outnumbered, the bear flees back towards the woods. The courageous dogs chase for a short while before wisely retreating once the bear disappears. While I wouldn't say these small dogs could actually fight a bear in a real battle, their bravery definitely scared away this giant creature. Their loyalty and courage in protecting their home are truly impressive. This next video captures a heart-pounding encounter between a kayaker and a black bear in Berg Bay, Alaska. The woman filming is clearly nervous as a large black bear approaches her on the shore. Go away! No! Get away from the kayak! Get away from that kayak! She tries to scare it off by calling out warnings and mentioning bear spray. While the spray initially seems to deter the bear, it soon turns its attention to the woman's kayak. Panic sets in as the bear starts gnawing on the kayak. The woman yells in distress, pleading with the bear to stop as it rips through the equipment. The video is difficult to watch as the once sturdy kayak is reduced to splinters. This encounter is a reminder of the importance of being prepared when venturing into bear country. Knowing how to use bear spray and having a backup plan are crucial for anyone exploring areas where wildlife might be present. If you got so far in the video, it means you're a dedicated viewer. Thank you. And if you subscribe and hit the bell button, I promise to keep posting these for you to enjoy. Imagine spotting a snow leopard in the wild, an elusive ghost of the mountains. That's an unforgettable experience in itself. But imagine capturing a video of this magnificent creature belting out its mating call. Now that's a once in a lifetime event. The guys at the White Lion Foundation got incredibly lucky with footage from a remote camera nestled in the Kaplu Valley of Pakistan. The video unveils a rare glimpse into the world of snow leopards we see one letting loose its wild serenade. A sound that's sure to surprise you. It's a unique mix of eerie and oddly captivating, a far cry from the mighty roar I might have imagined. But that's part of the magic of this footage. It showcases a side of snow leopards rarely seen. These solitary cats are masters of camouflage, spending most of their lives alone 
except for brief periods of mating and raising young. Capturing a snow leopard vocalizing in its natural habitat is a testament to the dedication of wildlife researchers and the incredible adaptability of these elusive creatures. Even though the call might not be the majestic roar we expect from such a powerful predator, it's a reminder of the beauty and intrigue that lurk within the wild world. I stumbled upon this video on Reddit, and let me tell you, the red blobs hanging from the ceiling are unlike anything I've ever seen. At first glance, they look kind of like fruit, but the more you watch, the weirder they get. These blobs have a strange, almost slimy texture, and there's even some goo dripping down from them. I did some research online to see if they could be spider eggs, but nothing matched what's in the video. The whole scene is seriously creepy, and it makes you wonder what these things really are. Are they some kind of unknown cave creature? Alien eggs from another world? Let me know what you think in the comments. Maybe you've seen something similar before, or have an idea of what they might be. If this video turns out to be a prank, I'll seriously plead with my friends to steer clear of attempting such antics on me because I'm not sure my heart could handle it. The video hails from India, showcasing footage from a security camera. In the nighttime scene, a strange creature emerges on the street. This creature is downright weird and creepy from every angle imaginable. It boasts long humanoid legs but lacks any upper body with just a flat circular surface up there. The way it strolls while maintaining balance is genuinely unsettling. Some viewers suspect it's a prank, suggesting the person might have concealed their upper body inside their shirt. Yet, to me, it seems nearly impossible for someone to hide their entire upper body, arms, and head in such a confined space. A friend duo went missing in Poland, and when the police investigated, they found their camera abandoned in a trash bin in a local park. What they found inside was truly bone chilling. <laughs> the video the police found was recorded by those friends, and it depicts a nighttime view of a park. One friend is filming the other goofing around when suddenly a mysterious figure enters the frame. The friends notice the stranger, but brush it off, thinking it's just someone drunk or playing a prank. However, the appearance of the stalker is unsettling, with a hunched back and a rag covering their face. As the stalker approaches, resembling a drunken person, the friends continue to play around, unaware of the danger they're in. When they feel that it is getting a bit creepy, they attempt to flee but the stalker relentlessly pursues them with their hunched posture. The stalker in the video may very well be the key to unraveling the mystery behind their disappearance. I mean, I have seen a few drunk people in my life, but this one seemed way creepier in his motivation to continue going after them. What do you think was going on in this clip? 23 million years ago, our oceans were home to terrifyingly massive creatures, including giant sharks, squid, and many other monsters. Nowadays, many believe these creatures to be extinct, but is that really the case? This video, captured in Hoven, Iceland, reveals a massive creature disrupting the water's surface. Waves ripple out from its movements, indicating its immense size. While some may speculate that it could be a whale or another large marine animal, the location suggests otherwise. Whales typically inhabit larger water bodies, not areas like this. Even if there's a chance they still exist, they wouldn't inhabit such small water bodies. They'd prefer the open ocean. So, the question remains, what could this creature be? This next video from TikTok had viewers scratching their heads in confusion, trying to make sense of what they were seeing. That's a pig! Beep. 
In the footage, recorded by a group of friends during a nighttime drive, they stumble upon a weird animal in the middle of the road. What makes this creature so confusing is its appearance, resembling a bizarre mix of a dog and a pig. The friends themselves are puzzled, unable to identify the strange hybrid. This creature has the body of a dog, but the face and feet resemble those of a pig. Its long, dog-like ears contrast with its pig-like belly, creating a truly mixed-up appearance. The unsettling part, its face. The combination of dog and pig features is downright eerie, sending shivers down your spine. While some may speculate, That's a pig! that it's a result of genetic mutation, encountering such a creature in the dead of night is undeniably chilling. Ever witnessed a caterpillar train? Watch this. The video you just watched showcases an incredible sight. A procession of caterpillars moving in a perfectly synchronized line. Each caterpillar is linked to the one in front and behind, creating a mesmerizing train-like formation. It's truly a fascinating spectacle, but what's really happening here? Prepare to be amazed. This is actually the mating train of these caterpillars. Each caterpillar is attached to a female they're seeking to mate with, forming this orderly procession. Their destination? A pupation site where they'll bury themselves in the soil and undergo metamorphosis into cocoons. These trains can be astonishingly long, sometimes consisting of over 300 caterpillars. Witnessing phenomena like this reminds us of the countless mysteries nature holds, just waiting to be discovered. This next video may seem like a scene straight out of a science fiction movie, but brace yourself because it's the real deal. Hailing from Texas, this footage captures the awe-inspiring yet chilling sight of a powerful tornado's formation. As the clip begins, the sky looms ominously dark with swirling clouds hinting at the tornado's impending birth. Suddenly, in a matter of seconds, this swirl intensifies, and a tornado starts to take shape, reaching down towards the ground. In just four seconds, it transforms into a fully-fledged tornado before the video abruptly ends. This rapid formation showcases the swift and unpredictable nature of tornadoes, leaving little time for people to seek safety in shelters. Authorities often issue advance warnings to help locals evacuate their homes in time. Despite the terror it evokes, the sheer power of nature displayed in this video is undeniably fascinating. When we think about bears, we usually picture them as strong and powerful creatures, not particularly known for their agility. But this video will definitely make you rethink that. Recorded by a hiker in Russia, the footage captures a bear swiftly descending a hill with remarkable speed. In just a matter of seconds, the bear covers the entire distance of the hill and reaches the bottom. As it charges down, it almost seems like it's on a mission, heading straight towards the hiker. Luckily, the hiker was safely inside a car at the time, allowing the bear to pass by without incident and the video concludes. Despite their hefty weight, which can reach up to 1,700 pounds, bears are surprisingly speedy creatures. Whether they're grizzlies, black bears, or polar bears, they can all outpace the average human, while there might be a few dog breeds known for their agility that could potentially keep up with a bear, your everyday pooch wouldn't stand a chance. So, the next time your friend boasts about being able to outrun a bear, just show them this clip. If you are enjoying this so far, consider subscribing. It really helps me keep this channel going. Now that you've seen how fast bears can be, let me show you just how simple it is to scare them.
This video, captured at a zoo, features a massive bear being startled by something as simple as a camera flash. As the bear emerges from the woods to enjoy its meal, it becomes a bit unsettled by the flashes from tourists' cameras. With each burst of light, the bear flinches slightly but continues to eat. These sudden flashes akin to lightning or thunder can often cause irritation, anxiety, and annoyance in animals, just as we see happening with this bear. What caught my attention were the scars on the bear's face, giving it a fierce appearance within its enclosure. It seems like this bear has weathered many battles in the wild, and was perhaps rescued due to injuries sustained. The flashes from the cameras are clearly making the bear uncomfortable while it tries to enjoy its meal, so it might be a good idea for the zoo owner to consider putting up no camera warning signs. A recent video captured on a beach in Victoria, Australia, showcases a creature that appears straight out of a science fiction film. There's creepy little legs. From its head to its tail, this creature is utterly bizarre. Its entire body length is covered in tiny little legs, which help it move along the sand. Its body has a strange, gooey appearance with an unusual texture. At first glance, it might resemble a snake, but upon closer inspection, it's clear that this creature is like nothing we've seen before. Its tail, with its strange orange hue, adds to the creature's all-worldly vibe. Even its tiny legs have a bluish tint to them. As it crawls, its movements create small waves in the sand, adding to the surreal scene. To me, this creature appears to be a distant cousin of eels or snakes, perhaps hailing from the mysterious depths of the ocean. But what do you think? It's certainly a fascinating sight to behold. This next video gives us a glimpse into every fisherman's fantasy. Recorded on a beach in Kerala, India, the video captures a truly remarkable sight. Thousands upon thousands of fish swarming out of the water onto the beach. Fishermen can be seen eagerly collecting these fish as they flood onto the shore, looking like a scene from a dream come true for them. They use bags to gather the abundant catch. But what exactly is happening here? It's not a miracle, but rather a natural phenomenon known as the sardine run. This incredible event involves the migration of millions of sardines from their usual cool, temperate habitat to the warmer subtropical waters of the Indian Ocean, along the east coast of South Africa. So. What you witness in the video is likely the result of these fish mistaking the beach for warmer waters and swarming towards it in a frenzy. It's a spectacular sight to witness and a reminder of the wildness of nature. Are you a skeptic when it comes to believing in aliens? If so, then this video might intrigue you. Captured by a group of divers in the North Pacific Ocean, the footage showcases an incredibly strange-looking sea creature. As the camera focuses on it, we see a fish with large, googly eyes and an unusual elongated shape. The diver recording the video even reaches out to touch the creature, prompting it to quickly shake in response. The fish's body is a shimmering silver color with a remarkably smooth texture. It's unlike anything many of us have ever seen before. While some may speculate that this creature could be an extraterrestrial visitor from the depths of space, I'm more inclined to believe it's a denizen of our own unexplored oceans. After all, a staggering 95% of our oceans remain undiscovered, leaving plenty of room for mysterious creatures to dwell. Regardless of its origins, Encountering such a unique creature serves as a reminder of the vast and enigmatic wonders that lie beneath the ocean's surface. You have seen stray dogs and cats roaming around the streets at night, but have you ever heard of encountering a stray lion on the streets? Well, it seems like it's not unheard of, especially in India. 
This video, filmed in Gujarat, India, captures a hair-raising moment as a biker comes face to face with a lion in the dead of night. Riding along a deserted road, the biker spots what he initially thinks is a dog approaching from the distance. But as he halts his bike, he realizes it's something far more intimidating. A lion. Instead of panicking and fleeing, the biker wisely chooses to stay on his bike as the lion casually approaches. Luckily, the lion doesn't seem hungry or aggressive. It simply leaps onto a nearby wall and saunters off into the darkness. Seizing the opportunity, the biker revs his engine and speeds away. Bringing the tense encounter to an end. Encountering such a majestic yet formidable creature at such close quarters must have been quite an experience. In such situations, keeping calm and avoiding sudden movements is key to ensuring your safety. It might sound like a tale from ancient mythology, but a family in South India stumbled upon a remarkable sight in their backyard. A two-headed beast. <laughs> While reptiles with two heads adjacent to each other have been documented in the wild, this creature boasts a head on each end of its body, seemingly taking turns to lead. Each head is equipped with its own pair of small hands, enabling the reptile to move swiftly and efficiently. Despite its unique anatomy, this two-headed marvel is neither venomous nor aggressive. According to the family who recorded the encounter, the creature primarily feeds on earthworms and measures between 4 to 5 inches in length. Remarkably, the two heads coordinate seamlessly, taking turns to control the body's movements. When one head takes the lead, the other follows suit, working in harmony to navigate its environment. Encountering such a rare and fascinating creature is truly a sight to behold reminding us of the spectacular mutations a creature can have in our animal kingdom. If you've ever wondered where the idea for Godzilla came from, you're in for a surprise. Doesn't it remind you of a mini version of the legendary Godzilla? This video, captured at the Galapagos Islands, showcases a fascinating creature. The marine iguana. While it may resemble your average iguana, this one is unique. It's adapted to life in the water. In the footage, we see it diving underwater to search for food using its tail to propel itself forward before resurfacing. Take a closer look at its body texture and eyes. Don't they seem intimidating, almost reminiscent of the legendary Godzilla? The white markings on its face and the way it moves its tail underwater bear a striking resemblance to the iconic movie monster. Also, these marine iguanas are incredibly rare and can only be found in the Galapagos region. Their ability to forage underwater sets them apart from other lizards, making them truly unique creatures. Now, who wouldn't want a mini Godzilla for their fish aquarium after seeing this? A bizarre creature spotted in an Indonesian village has sent shivers down the spines of internet users, especially those with a fear of bugs. What you just witnessed isn't something from outer space, but rather a creature spotted in an Indonesian village. This bizarre insect has a moth-like upper body, but what really catches the eye are the four tufted tendrils sprouting from its abdomen. These tendrils covered in hair, are surprisingly long. Many folks on social media were left utterly terrified after catching a glimpse of this otherworldly insect. One person even said, he'd burn the house down if he saw this. But fear not, this moth isn't an extraterrestrial visitor. It's actually a known insect called Creatonotos gangus moth. Those unusual tentacles, their scent organs used by the moth to produce pheromones, all in an effort to attract mates. Still, even with this explanation, some viewers are adamant. They don't want this creature coexisting with humans on planet Earth. 
If the moth gave you chills, brace yourself for this video. <laughs> Recorded on a beach, this video showcases a truly strange octopus starfish hybrid creature. What sets it apart is the thousands of tiny legs covering its underside. It's as if this creature uses these legs to navigate the sandy terrain. When the family who spotted it tried pouring water on it, the creature remained unresponsive, continuing to wiggle its tiny legs underneath. It appears to be injured or distressed, as it only moves its legs while the rest of its body remains still. Unlike regular starfish with five arms, this one boasts ten tentacles, each equipped with its own set of tiny legs. As for its identity and behavior, it's still a mystery. It looks like those big octopus sea monsters from movie. If you have any insights, feel free to share them in the comments below. If you got so far in the video, it means you're a dedicated viewer. Thank you. And if you subscribe and hit the bell button, I promise to keep posting these for you to enjoy. Albinism is more common in humans than animals, but have you ever come across an albino turtle? In this video, what you're seeing isn't a toy. It's a real-life yellow turtle discovered in India. Farmer Basu Dev stumbled upon this little guy while working in the fields and decided to bring it home. He captured this footage for us to witness just how vibrant yellow this turtle is. Not only is its body yellow, but its shell is entirely yellow too, which is quite fascinating. When Basu Dev zooms in for a close-up, you can even see through the shell, revealing the turtle's bones. The yellow hue makes the shell appear transparent. Animal researchers and scientists attribute this coloration to albinism, which causes the turtle to lose its shell color, turning it entirely yellow. Despite its majestic appearance, this turtle will face challenges due to albinism, such as sensitivity to sunlight and light. So if you've seen this unique yellow turtle, don't go searching for a pink one for your girlfriend. Those don't exist. Imagine venturing into the depths of a forest at night, the darkness enveloping everything, and then encountering a sight that sends shivers down your spine. This video, although blurry, captures such a chilling moment. Given its size and the setting, speculation runs wild. Could this be the legendary Bigfoot, often rumored to roam secluded forests? Or might it be a bear, its stature and eyes visible, just enough to be caught on camera? Alternatively, the skeptical mind might wonder if this is a clever hoax, designed to stir up fear or excitement. The ambiguity of the footage, combined with the eerie setting, fuels the mystery. The creature remains unidentified, its intentions unclear, and its reality uncertain. If I was the man filming this video, I would have ran away as fast as possible as the possibility of me being so close to such a creature during the night into the forest terrifies me. I hear it. A chilling scenario set deep within the woods at night was captured in this unnerving video. Hey! High up in one of the towering trees, an unexpected and horrifying sight unfolds. There, amidst the dark silhouettes of the branches, is a girl. But this is no ordinary scene of a child climbing a tree. It's something far more unsettling. The girl is screaming, her cries alarming all the residents, and her movements are erratic, almost as if she's thrashing or bouncing against her will. The scene gives off an intense feeling that she might be possessed, exhibiting behavior that's typically associated with horror tales of individuals overtaken by forces beyond their control. The entire spectacle is deeply unsettling, transforming the natural setting of the woods into a backdrop for a terrifying encounter. The video leaves me with a lingering sense of dread. 
and the uneasy question, what could have caused such a disturbing display? There is a substance straight out of a horror movie that no one has been able to explain, even to this day. Yeah, it's just kind of gooey and stretchy, it looks kind of like tar. This is what many beachgoers have noticed at South Carl's. We're exploring a series of images and clips reporting on peculiar black sticky blobs appearing along the beach. These strange substances spark a wave of curiosity and intrigue, looking so out of this world that people can't help but wonder if they've stumbled upon something alien. The first accounts of this substance dates back to 1986 in Caracas, Venezuela, but it has been appearing every now and then, and there are cases of death from this unknown substance. The blobs are unusual and captivating, creating a buzz among locals and visitors alike. They're gooey and dark, contrasting starkly with the usual beach scenery, leading to all sorts of wild guesses about their origin. Could they be some bizarre form of sea life pollution or even evidence of extraterrestrial life? Despite almost two decades of study and millions of dollars spent identifying it, the cause of the substance has proven difficult and there are still no definitive explanations as to how it appeared. I find this video very interesting as I have never heard of this phenomenon and it created a mystery yet to be solved. Embark on a mysterious journey into the forest at night, where the video at hand captures something truly unusual. High up in the branches of one of the trees, there's movement that catches the eye. A black, hairy figure skillfully navigating through the limbs. The creature's presence is initially obscured by the dense foliage. But as the video continues, we get a clearer view. What emerges from behind the leaves is astonishing. The creature bears a striking resemblance to what many would identify as Bigfoot, a legendary being that's been the subject of folklore and countless eyewitness accounts. Whether this is a genuine sighting of the elusive Bigfoot or just a trick of the light and shadow in the forest remains open to interpretation. Yet the video undoubtedly offers a fascinating and unsettling encounter with something extraordinary in the still of the night. I incline to think that this video is real, and the face of the creature with that creepy smile gives me shivers down the spine. We're introduced to a girl, seemingly engrossed in making a video, completely oblivious to the eerie occurrence unfolding behind her. As the camera rolls, an unusual and chilling spectacle emerges from behind the wall, just over the girl's shoulder. It's a translucent figure, but its presence is subtle, not drawing any immediate attention from the girl, which adds an even more sinister layer to the unfolding scene. Unexpectedly, the creature retracts, stopping short of actual touch. This moment of near interaction frightened me. Who knows what this creature might have done? It's as if I'm watching a scene from a horror movie where the boundary between the ordinary and the paranormal is blurred, leaving me on edge and questioning what might happen next. I recently visited Lake Como, one of the deepest lakes in Europe, and I want to share with you some strange things the lake is known to have all sort of things at its bottom. As you can see in this clip, it is a graveyard for cars, tanks, warplanes, and all sort of things. But the lake is famous for something else, something creepier. It is said that somewhere at its bottom lies a monster called Lariosaro, similar to the one we all know at Loch Ness. The earliest sighting dates to 1946, Eyewitnesses allegedly reported seeing a reptile-like animal swimming in the waters of the lake. It is said to not be aggressive unless disturbed. However, folklore says otherwise, with some encounters being deadly. 
There are even earlier reports of its existence, dating as old as several hundred years, with old pictures immortalizing these claims. So if you want to visit Italy, I suggest you take a trip to this ancient lake as well. But be careful if you think of diving in the water. If you are enjoying this so far, consider subscribing. It really helps me keep this channel going. In this video, we're introduced to an extraordinary and somewhat unsettling creature that defies the usual expectations of wildlife. At first glance, the creature's head resembles that of a dog, equipped with notably sharp teeth, suggesting a fierce nature. However, as the camera continues to record, it reveals that the rest of the creature is far from what one might anticipate following the canine-like head. Instead of a dog's body, the creature boasts a form that eerily mirrors a human's, complete with a humanoid torso and an enlarged belly, which adds an unusual dimension to its appearance. The limbs are present, yet they deviate from the norm. The arms are devoid of hands, and the legs, although shorter, end in feet that bear a resemblance to human feet in their shape. The creature's skin is a distinct gray, enhancing its otherworldly look. Even more intriguing is the fact that, despite appearing unconscious, there are visible signs of breathing, making me anxious thinking about the possibility that it could wake up at any time and harm the person filming. I have no idea what this creature could be, but if you know, let us know in the comments. Imagine witnessing a scene that defies everything you know about fire and water. As the video plays, we see an individual attempting to extinguish this unusual fire with more water, intuitively thinking it will douse the flames. However, the fire only grows more intense with each attempt. This unexpected turn of events adds to the intrigue, leaving viewers puzzled and in awe. The spectacle of fire burning on water is a fascinating study in contrasts. Typically, water is the go-to extinguisher for flames, but here it seems to feed the fire instead of fighting it. This scenario might involve flammable substances floating on the water or underground gases feeding the flames from below, turning a simple act of nature into a captivating display of its complexity and mystery. I find this phenomenon extraordinary, giving life to the metaphor. Embark on a spine-tingling journey through a scene that might just challenge your beliefs in the ordinary. Out of nowhere, an eerie incident occurs. The woman's hair appears to be mysteriously pulled backward. Yet there's no one else in sight. No visible presence, no hands reaching out, nothing that could logically explain her hair's sudden movement. The room is still. The dog beside her remains undisturbed, oblivious to the strange event. This peculiar moment naturally stirs thoughts of the supernatural. Could this be the work of an unseen entity, a ghostly presence making itself known in the most unsettling way? The lack of any visible cause for the hair pulling intensifies the mystery, wrapping the scene in a cloak of the paranormal. Poor woman, if I were her, I would call a priest as soon as possible. Step into a moment of intrigue right at the entrance of a garage, where this video captures a peculiar and fascinating creature. Initially, it might seem like we're looking at a small black frog, a common enough sight in some areas. However, as the camera zooms in and we get a closer look, it becomes clear that this is no ordinary frog. The creature's head is elongated, straying from the typical round shape we associate with frogs. Even more intriguing 
is the absence of visible features we'd expect to see, like eyes or a mouth. This lack of identifiable characteristics adds a layer of mystery to the creature, sparking curiosity about its true nature. The video leaves me pondering several questions. Is this an unusual species of amphibian? Perhaps a rare or less known variety? Could it be a creature in a transitional stage of its life? Or maybe it's something entirely different, defying our expectations of familiar wildlife. Imagine stepping into a farm field, the camera rolling, capturing the rustic charm of the countryside. Suddenly the video zeroes in on an intriguing sight, a skunk cabbage, freshly uprooted, lying in the open field. This is a skunk cabbage that grows down along. This isn't just any ordinary glimpse of flora. What stands out is the extraordinary appearance of the plant, particularly its root system. As the camera focuses, the skunk cabbage reveals its otherworldly beauty. The roots are dense, intricate, and spread out in a complex network that captivates the viewer's attention. They exhibit an almost alien quality, as if this plant could belong to a landscape far removed from our earthly familiarities. The sheer uniqueness of the skunk cabbage, especially in its uprooted state, turns this simple video into a fascinating visual exploration. I am not familiar with this plant and seeing it for the first time in this video made me think of an alien plant at first. In this intriguing image from the Pyrin Mountains of southwestern Bulgaria, we're presented with a captivating mystery embedded in stone. The photograph shows a man's foot placed beside a remarkable impression on a rock, a colossal footprint that seems to echo the shape of a human foot but is magnified to an astonishing scale, at least eight times larger. The footprint's most striking feature is its toes, which bear a striking resemblance to those of a human, suggesting familiarity yet paired with the unknown. The rest of the footprint, however, veers into the realm of the mysterious, with proportions and contours that don't quite match our expectations of a human foot, hinting at a creature of extraordinary size and perhaps unknown origin. The mind races with possibilities. Could this be evidence of giants, as suggested by myths and legends that span cultures and eras, creatures of immense stature whose existence has faded into folklore? Or might this imprint hint at the existence of Bigfoot? The elusive creature reported in various sightings throughout the world, yet remaining shrouded in skepticism and mystery? This image left me with more questions than answers and I am very curious of knowing what could have left such a mark, and if the creature still exists. If you got so far in the video, it means you're a dedicated viewer. Thank you. And if you subscribe and hit the bell button, I promise to keep posting these for you to enjoy. Imagine encountering a creature so unusual it seems to challenge the laws of nature itself. This tiny reptile, with its pair of heads atop a single body, appears as if plucked from a realm of fantasy or a mythical story. This rare condition, known as bicephaly, is a form of conjoined twinning, but is exceptionally uncommon in reptiles. The two heads sharing one body might make you think of mythical creatures or beings from a realm of fantasy, yet here it is a living turtle that defies common natural expectations. It is fascinating how these animals with bicephaly can live without problems. They give us a rare glimpse of nature's diversity. Step into a scene that blurs the line between the familiar and the utterly mysterious. This video captured on a Texas beach, presents us with a creature that defies easy categorization. Imagine being on Bolivar Beach and this turns up. 
KH11 viewer Patricia share It kind of looks like an anemone you'd find in the ocean, with lots of tentacles that are soft and jelly-like. But here's where it gets super weird. The creature's mouth. It's big and looks super scary. Kind of like the mouth of a sea lamprey, but even larger. This isn't something you'd want to bump into while swimming. The creature's color is another strange thing. It's gray, which isn't what you'd expect for something like an anemone. This unusual color makes it look even more out of the ordinary. So what is this thing? Is it just a strange kind of anemone? Or is it something we've never seen before? The video leaves me guessing, showing me just how many weird and wonderful things there might be out there that we still don't know about. Embark on an up-close exploration of one of nature's more ethereal creations, captured in this video where a man holds a fascinating creature in his hand. The fish's mouth is notably sharp and pointed, resembling an arrowhead, which adds to its unusual and striking appearance. This pointed mouth is likely an adaptation to its natural environment, helping it catch its prey in the cold waters it usually inhabits. Transparency in fish, like that seen in the ice fish, is an extraordinary adaptation. It's often a form of camouflage, making the fish nearly invisible to predators and prey in the water. Despite being out of water in this video, the ice fish retains its see-through appearance, allowing us to marvel at its unique physiology up close. This type of fish is a very interesting sight to see, and thanks to the video, we have the opportunity to dive in the diversity of the nature. Imagine peering through the lens of a ring camera typically a silent guardian of the night, when it captures a surprising visit right at the front of a house. As the night unfolds in front of the camera, we see these two coyotes up close, engaged in a rather domestic act. They're feasting from an animal food bowl left outside, but the feast is interrupted when one of the coyotes becomes aware of the camera's presence. As the animal pauses, its eyes possibly catching the camera's glint, or sensing its unusual nature in their familiar foraging ground. In an unexpected twist, the coyote's response is to take action. It decides to claim the camera itself, perhaps as a trophy or out of sheer curiosity, grabbing it in its mouth and making off with it. I personally enjoy seeing how animals react to human environment and gadgets, how curious they get, and how they interplay with our daily life objects. Step into the quiet world of a field at night, observed through the watchful eye of a trail camera. The deer turns to face the camera directly, and what unfolds next is a captivating display. It begins to move its hind legs in an unusual manner, almost as if it's performing a dance. This peculiar behavior is fascinating, seeming as though the deer is aware of the camera's presence and has decided to put on a show, or perhaps it's engaging in a natural behavior that just happens to resemble a dance. This unexpected dance could be a spontaneous display of playfulness or a rare behavior triggered by the deer's interaction with its environment, possibly even a response to the infrared light or the slight sound from the camera. I find this video very interesting, as it seems like the deer is aware that it is being filmed and decided to set up a show. Bigfoot Believers Assemble this next clip is straight from a trail camera deep in the heart of a forest. And let me tell you, it's gonna tingle your beliefs. The footage you just watched was captured by a trail camera originally set up to monitor the fox population in the area. 
However, it unexpectedly recorded a large, hairy figure passing in front of it. The proximity of the figure to the camera only allows for the middle part of its body to be visible. Even from this limited perspective, it's evident that the creature possesses a tall humanoid stature, as inferred from its walking pattern, and the heavy footsteps it produces, which means it can't be a bear. With its thick body hair and humanoid gait, this entity strongly resembles the legendary Bigfoot. While we can't say for certain, it's 100% Bigfoot without seeing the whole thing. But one thing's for sure, this ain't your average woodland critter. What do you think, Bigfoot or something else? Have you ever gotten that creepy feeling at night? You know, that prickle on the back of your neck, like unseen eyes are burning into your every move? We all brush it off sometimes. But what if there really was something out there? In the bush. Look at that. This chilling video from Florida was captured by a guy who just couldn't shake that feeling. As he was passing a bush, he heard some noise coming from within. He shone his flashlight into the bushes, convinced something was stalking him. To his surprise, a pair of eyes glinted right back. Intrigued, and maybe a little foolish, our cameraman walks right towards them. Now, here's where things get seriously weird. As he gets closer, another set of eyes appears way up high, way above the first. By the time he reaches the original eyes, it turns out to be just a wildcat, ready to pounce, definitely a threat, but not exactly the monster we were expecting. The real mystery here, those other eyes, their height suggests something much bigger, something truly formidable lurking in the shadows. This footage is just giving me goosebumps. Imagine throwing open your curtains on a bright morning, expecting a view of clear blue skies. But instead, you're greeted by this. This head-scratching video, captured by an apartment dweller in Denver, showcases a truly strange phenomenon. A giant black smoke ring hangs ominously in the sky. With no apparent source in sight, it adds a layer of mystery to the already curious event. Apparently, dozens of Denver residents weren't the only ones witnessing this oddity. Similar sightings have been reported from countries as far-flung as Russia and Pakistan. The ring itself resembles a puff of smoke blown into the air, slowly morphing as it floats. News outlets also scrambled to explain the spectacle with theories ranging from extraterrestrial visitors to malfunctioning transformers, even a flock of coordinated insects. Whatever the true explanation, one thing's for sure, most of us wouldn't exactly relish being directly under that mysterious smoke ring. This next video is the kind that makes me question reality, because if it's true, I'll be haunted by lakes forever. In this footage, we see a serene lake captured from a distance. Everything seems calm until you spot something emerging from the water's surface. It resembles a head, swimming with only its top visible. As the cameraman observes, a boat passes by, seemingly unfazed by the presence of this mysterious entity. The cameraman is also left confused unsure whether it's just a piece of floating debris or an actual creature. Despite its movement, some viewers speculate it could be the legendary Loch Ness Monster. Personally, I lean towards it being driftwood given its consistent speed and lack of additional movement. But even with my skepticism, there's a lingering fear that if this video is even 1% real, I'll be avoiding lakes for the rest of my days. This next video from a YouTube channel that delves into a strange mystery that has left scientists and researchers scratching their heads for over 15 years. Back then, in Chile's Atacama Desert, 
A mummified skeleton was unearthed. And let me tell you, it's unlike anything you've ever seen. Some people even suggest it might be, well, alien. This little skeleton stands only six inches tall, but its appearance is downright strange. Despite its petite size, the bones tell us it belonged to a child, aged between six to eight years. The lower body resembles that of a human, complete with legs, arms, and a rib cage. But things start to get odd as you move up. Its collarbone is shaped like a U, and its neck is unusually long compared to the rest of its body. And then there's the head, elongated from the forehead with slanted eye sockets. This mysterious creature even made appearances on television shows and documentaries. So, was it truly an alien? We're still scratching our heads over that one. Scientists have thrown around a bunch of theories. Some suggest it might be a mutated baby with elongated bones. But honestly, those are just theories for now. I usually hop on TikTok to see adorable animals and fun dances. But every now and then, a video like this pops up and shakes me up. The video came from a TikTok account and showed a really strange encounter. In it, we see a car being followed by a mysterious figure late at night on a deserted road. This figure looked somewhat human, but its appearance was bizarre and unsettling. The driver, understandably alarmed, cautiously backed away from the figure, but it continued to follow them with an eerie, unnatural walk. Honestly, the whole thing gives me the creeps. Imagine being in that situation with some unknown person. Or who knows, maybe something else, heading your way in the dead of night. You're left wondering, what's their deal? Why are they out there at that hour? And what were they planning to do? If you are enjoying this so far, consider subscribing. It really helps me keep this channel going. There are folks who believe in aliens, and then there are those who don't. But if you're in the latter group, this video might just make you rethink things. Straight out of Mexico, this clip looks like it's been plucked from a sci-fi flick. It was captured by a driver going back home from his night shift. In his capture, there's this strange beam descending from the sky, and at its source, there's this eerie glow. Whatever's emitting that light seems pretty massive judging by the glow's size. Now, this beam isn't just hanging in mid-air. It's targeting a spot in the distance. It's like something out of those movies where beams snatch up humans and critters. And sure, you might think, this could be computer-generated imagery. But honestly, the way that beam and glow blend seamlessly with the surroundings, it's pretty convincing. So, if this isn't some hoax, Maybe we should start getting ready for those alien abductors making their move. Ready to witness creatures straight out of my wildest fever dream? What could it be? This clip unfolds on a beach, where a family stumbled upon a truly bizarre and massive creature during their trip. It's unlike anything you've ever seen, a gooey mass with an orange hue adorned with flame like patterns. But that's not the end of it. Something seems to be trying to emerge from within the creature, forming bubbles that resemble a mouth as if it's breathing. As you move closer to the center of the mass, it appears white with a rougher, orange texture towards the outer edges. Plus, it's got tentacle-like appendages both around and within its body, some of which are transparent. This whole situation is just plain strange. Maybe it's a creature from the mysterious depths of the ocean that got washed up on the shore. Or perhaps it's some kind of alien entity. But whatever it is, the way that kid took a picture sitting so close to it is seriously scary and dangerous. You never know what this creature could be capable of. Living in California, it's not just thieves and burglars you need to worry about locking your car doors against.
The clip you just watched isn't from a cartoon. It's real footage captured by a DoorDash camera. The bear cautiously looks around to ensure no one's watching. Then it starts tugging at the car door handle with its mouth and paws. However, since the car was locked, the bear couldn't get in. Undeterred, it moves on to a nearby truck parked there. Unfortunately for the owner and lucky for the bear, the truck door was left unlocked, making it easy for the bear to open it. Always lock your car doors, even if you're parked in your own driveway. Bears, often in search of food, will explore wherever they can, and that's why the bear in the video decided to venture into the cars. This video shows you what happens when you goof off and don't pay attention. Get him, oh get, him, get him, get him! Something emerges from the water and clamps onto his hand. It's a shark, and its bite is so forceful that it drags the man into the water. The other friends immediately react, shouting and scrambling to rescue their friend from the shark's grip. Get him, get him, get him, get him! With quick teamwork, they manage to pull him back onto the boat. Luckily, the situation ended without serious injuries, but the danger was very real. The shark mistook the man's hand for prey and attacked without warning. This serves as a chilling reminder of the importance of exercising caution and avoiding risky behavior, especially in unfamiliar waters. If you thought the person in the last video was making questionable decisions, just wait until you see what's in this one. On the way out. On the way out. Oh! Yes, you saw it right. The man in this video was quite literally asking for trouble by tempting a crocodile. Filmed by tourists at a zoo, the footage shows a man, probably a tamer, playfully interacting with a crocodile. He even dares to touch the crocodile's wide open mouth. And surprisingly, the crocodile remains calm, allowing the man to continue his risky behavior. But things take a dangerous turn when the man pushes his luck too far while inserting his hand into the crocodile's mouth. Predictably, the crocodile snaps shut, narrowly missing the man's hand. Despite this close call, the man doesn't seem to learn his lesson. He repeats the reckless act this time with unfortunate consequences as the crocodile manages to land a bite. The cameraman witnessing this alarming scene quickly turns away the camera, clearly disturbed by what they've seen. This is precisely why I emphasize time and time again that playing with wild animals is incredibly risky. You never know when they might react unpredictably, as they're called wild for a reason. Have you ever had that chilling thought of something lurking in the toilet while you're seated? We've all entertained that fear at some point. But what if I told you there's a video that brings that nightmare to life? The snake there is sizable and certainly not something you'd want to encounter while answering nature's call. The family swiftly contacts a snake catching rescue team who can be seen in the video attempting to apprehend the intruding serpent. With the help of snake hooks, the rescue team carefully maneuvers the snake out of the toilet hole. As it slithers out, they swiftly capture it and transport it outside. The size of the snake becomes apparent as it's pulled from the toilet hole. It's quite a sight. Surprisingly, both the rescue team and the homeowner who's recording the incident, remain remarkably calm, even sharing a laugh. This nonchalant attitude might seem strange, but in Thailand, encounters with snakes are quite common. After watching this video, I'm sure many of us will think twice before taking a seat on the toilet. This next clip shows how quick thinking and staying alert can be the difference between life and death. The scene you just witnessed took place during the 2020 Beirut explosion. Before the blast, a massive fire broke out at a nearby fireworks factory, which this family witnessed from the rooftop of their nearby home. 
Sensing danger as they watched the fire intensify, the family made a split-second decision to seek shelter inside their house. Their instincts proved crucial as moments after they entered, the explosion rocked the area. The force of the blast was immense, causing everything in its path to erupt like balloons. Walls crumbled and plastic tanks exploded under the sheer pressure. The family narrowly escaped tragedy by acting swiftly and trusting their instincts. Had they been even slightly delayed, they could have been caught in the devastating shockwave. My friends always ask me why I'm not a fan of surfing, and I show them this clip from the World Surf League. Captured by App News, this video shows a surfer engaged in a one-on-one -on -one battle with a mighty shark. The surfer, thrown into a panic, uses his surfboard to fend off the shark. After a struggle, he manages to swim away to safety. In a post-interview with App News, the surfer explains that while waiting for a wave, he felt something pulling him underwater. He then felt the presence of the shark behind him and instinctively punched it, causing the shark to retreat momentarily. This gave him the opportunity to escape, and he was later rescued by lifeguards. It's a chilling sight, and one can only imagine the fear the surfer experienced during the encounter. This adds yet another reason to my list of why I'll stick to dry land and avoid surfing. Remember when you were a kid and mistakenly grabbed someone else's hand at the mall, thinking it was your mom? Well, this video captures a similar adorable mix-up. But with a koala, in this adorable video captured by a dog owner, a baby koala latches onto his dog, mistaking it for its mother. At first, the scene is undeniably cute, with the dog seemingly unfazed by the koala's clinginess. However, as the koala climbs on top of the dog, the dog starts to feel a bit annoyed. But the determined little marsupial firmly believes the dog is its mother. The interaction continues with the dog attempting to free itself while the koala holds on tightly. Perhaps the koala finally realized that the dog wasn't its mother, just like how we after some time realizes our mistake at the mall. You might have good luck in life, but you can't get luckier than this. Pretty lucky, right? In this incredible footage captured by a couple of divers during their expedition in the Pacific Ocean, as one diver was filming, a massive shark suddenly appeared from the background and zoomed past the diver, coming dangerously close to taking a bite out of their head. It was a heart-stopping moment as the shark even opened its mouth, ready to strike. However, the lucky diver showed some quick reflexes and managed to lower their head just in time, narrowly avoiding the shark's attack. I don't believe the shark had any intention of attacking the diver. They probably just got in the shark's way while swimming. Nonetheless, it was an incredibly intense and scary encounter, seeing such a huge shark appear out of nowhere. A group of friends set out on a drive to test the new forward-looking infrared night vision system on their ultimate tow rig, but what they captured on camera was far from what they expected. As they cruised down a desolate road at night for the test, they encountered a bizarre sight, a hairy humanoid creature crossing their path. Multiple cameras mounted on the truck recorded the mysterious being, revealing its tall, humanoid appearance and unique walk that didn't resemble any known animal. The creature, brown in color, stood out against the darkness of the night. According to the friends, this creature resembled the legendary Bigfoot, with sightings reported in other parts of Grizzled Gloosh in recent times. So what do you think? Was it truly Bigfoot, or perhaps just someone pulling a prank on the friends? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments. For more captivating content like this, click here. Thanks for exploring the weird with me.